how to get monetized on YouTube. You've clicked on this video because you want to know how to get monetized on YouTube. So do I, that is my journey. This is the start of the journey. So let's get into it. Hello, my name is Max and this is Vikings. This video is how to get monetized on YouTube. This is the first video. This is the very beginning video we're going to make on this. Now I'm going to go through this video. I'm going to teach you about myself, about who I am, how new I am to this, my experience of this so far, and what I've done so far in my journey on becoming monetized on YouTube. This is the first video, but this is not where it has started for me. This is where I've pressed play for the first time. Yes, that is correct. But this is not where my journey began on YouTube. I want to take you back a little bit and show you where I started in terms of my journey on how to become monetized on YouTube. So my goal throughout this entire series, throughout this entire playlist, is to bring you an update once a week with my data analytics and the things that I've been doing in the background to teach you, to tell you how I became monetized on YouTube. Now, this is a bit of a promise because I'm not monetized on YouTube. It's out of my hands. It's out of my control. It could even be the case that I may never be monetized on YouTube, but I'm sure I will because I'm going to remain consistent. So my rules, my rules that I've set myself on to become monetized on YouTube. Now, I want to take my rules out of the hands of others, out of these external forces. So if I say I want 10,000 subscribers in the first year, I know some realistic round numbers. If I say I want these 10,000 subscribers in the first year, that is out of my control. That is me setting a promise to myself that other people are going to click the subscribe button. That is not a good idea. These are external forces. These are out of my control. This is a bad idea to start in this way. I can see why you would want to, but you would really become disheartened if it wasn't happening. You would really put all your faith into getting people to press subscribe button and it's out of your control. It's impossible to control. Don't do it. It's a losing battle. It's a losing goal. Your goals should always be what you can control. So my first rule is I will release two videos minimum every single week. Minimum. Forever. Until I'm monetized. Until I'm monetized. And even then, I probably will up it after that. But that is my rule to become monetized. Rule number one is a minimum of two videos every week. I may go three, four, five, six, seven, who knows, but a minimum of two every single week. I've been doing my research on this. I've started the process of doing my research. I've been watching videos. I've been watching videos of people who have done this journey themselves. Um, for example, there is a channel called Silver and Solo. This is a lady that decided at the start of 2024 that she would become monetized. Today, if you don't know, it is the 8th of July, 2024. My name's Max. I am 35 years old and I'm nearly 36. You know, you don't need to think I need to be this 13-year-old, 15-year-old starting out at that young age. This is where I'm starting. This is where I'm starting at this age, 35 years old in 2024. Rule number two. Rule number two, my rule number two, what I am going to follow to become monetized is study. Throughout my entire life, I never really studied as a younger man. I was misguided. I didn't really know how to achieve and succeed at things. But as I got older, I started to realize that I need to apply myself, implement, study. And every time I've done that, without fail, I have succeeded at what I wanted. At what I wanted out of that. I always succeeded. When I realize applying for myself and studying, that is what gets me what I want. What I want in this one is to become monetized. I mean, this is what the whole video is about. You know this. That's what I want. I'm going to study and apply myself and I will become monetized. So what am I going to study? So this could be a number of things. And I told you this is not the start. I've already been studying. I've already started this journey. So my original study was to look at people on YouTube, Silver and Solo you have vidIQ, you have Think Media, you're going, on, you're going on to these channels, I'm going on to these channels, I am watching their videos, taking their advice on how to start a YouTube channel. 
what I've realized by watching these videos, especially vidIQ, they have told me to front run my research, my studies on the things that have the highest impact on watches. So the things that have the highest impact on watches is the thumbnail, the title of the video and the intro. So this is where my study has started. I've seen little bits of the title of the video. I've taken that in a little bit, but that has not been the topic of my research. The topic of my research and study so far has been on the thumbnail. And one thing I've completely changed from what I expected to happen when making this YouTube channel was I expected to make a video like this, do all the editing, the video is great, I'm so happy with the video, I'm ecstatic, and then we make a thumbnail. No. That's what I expected, no. That is what I expected to do and that is not what I'm going to do going forward. My research, my research has told me to make the thumbnail first. Put your time and energy in the thumbnail. Spend twice as long on the thumbnail than you thought you was going to spend on the thumbnail in the first place. Also, make it half as busy. Make it so much less busy, less stuff going on. Make it easy to read. So my research on around thumbnails has been, it needs to be bright. As you could probably see in this thumbnail, it's very, very bright. It needs to have a small amount of writing. As you could probably see in the thumbnail, it just says YouTube money. There you go, you, you're kind of getting an idea of what is in that video. It needs to be no more than three things on the thumbnail itself. So you have me, you have YouTube, and then you have the, uh, and the word money. So that is it, super, super simple. That is what I've learned. Honestly, I genuinely would have thought the busier, the cooler the picture would have been the thing that would have helped my channel grow. But that is absolutely not the case. I genuinely thought it would be really cool colors um, and just really like dramatic scenery. Absolutely not, that's not the case. Bright colors, contrasting colors. These are the things that I've been learning for a week. I've been studying this for a week and making these thumbnails. I made three thumbnails for this one video. That is another thing. Make three thumbnails for one video. Put the one that you think's the best. What I'm also gonna do, I'm gonna pretend I've got a phone, I haven't, I've got this cocoa butter. So I'm gonna just pretend it's a phone. So what I want you to do is you wanna put your thumbnail on the phone, make it small, small, as in how small you would see it on YouTube yourself when clicking on a video. I want you to go to a friend and family member and go one, two. What do you think was that video was about? What was in that video looking at that screenshot? I want you to do that and also ask them, of the three thumbnails that you've created, which one was the best with them? What resonated with them? Which one stood out? Which one did they feel like they would click on? Because you will have a lot of bias in this situation. You will have so much bias because you've spent time creating it and you may have your favorite one. So ignore your bias. Trust your family member. What would they click on? What do they think is in the video? Ask them that question. One, two, what, which one would they pick? That's what you wanna do. That is another skill that you should learn. That's another thing you should do when making these thumbnails. So a lot of study, I've put so much study into the thumbnail, I'm front running the highest impact thing that will get people to watch videos and this channel to become monetized. If no one's watching the videos, this channel does not become monetized. So I need to get people watching those videos. So that is topic number one, thumbnails. I don't think I'm done with them yet. I need to keep researching, maybe another week into it. Uh, do the research on thumbnails. Then I think I'm going on, then I'm going on to titles. Titles, I've took on a little bit of knowledge. I kind of know how to uh, do titles, but in a future video, once I start really studying titles, we'll talk about my research and what I've learned. This week was a study of thumbnails. What we'll do now is we're going to get into the data analytics. Okay, so this is my channel. This is the start of my channel. I mentioned this was not the start of the journey. Looking at it here, you can see at the moment, currently I have 89 subscribers. I have 9,200 views, 9.2K views, and 281.4 hours of watch time. This is an old channel. If you've noticed here, that actually about six years ago, I did start this channel. I did not intend to become monetized on YouTube. This was a journey that me and my wife took, uh, traveling in a van, 
We traveled in a van around Europe and we posted these videos. It was not our intention for this to blow up. Our intention was to record our journey, to look back on it like a diary, like a time capsule, something that for the rest of our life we could go back and enjoy. So these are the videos that we posted through van life, our van life journey. The channel has changed, so these subscribers are all based off of the van life videos. Uh, these, again, when it was not a channel that was intended to blow up and become really successful. It was just a diary for myself and my wife. So that is it. You've seen the data analytics. We're basically starting from zero in this 365 days to monetization. If you like the idea of following this journey, do not forget to like down below, subscribe, click the notification bell. So the next update that I post next week, you will get that update and you'll see the progress we're making one step at a time. For those of you that do not know me, I am a certified financial advisor as my profession. As part of my profession, I've created a course, an online video course, where you can watch small little videos on how to become financially free, financially independent. The course is in the description down below via Payhip and Viking University. So click on the link. Do not forget to use the promo code NET, N-E-T. It's down there in the description as well. So if you do want to become financially free, if you want to become financially independent, if you do not want to rely on an, an employer to support you and your family, if you want to retire early and enjoy a fulfilling life, then go to the course below, put in the promo code and start your journey. The course is long. It's like nearly 16 hours long worth of video. So it's going to take you a long time to get through, but it will transform your life and help you become financially free and financially independent. So that is it. That is the first video on becoming monetized on YouTube. First video ever. We're going to go on this journey together. So again, do not forget to like, subscribe and click the notification bell. And I look forward to seeing you next week and posting those analytics and see if we have any updates. So come on, fingers crossed. Let's go. Let's go.